my background is definitely the background of a gambler. I've been gambling since I was 12 years old. Started off with parlaying my $5 allowance for my dad. I've been playing poker since I was about 17 years old. When, uh, when the pool room would close, everybody would pull up chairs around the pool table and play really bad. And uh, it was weird because it's like the whole time the pool room was open, everybody is trying to get the smallest little edge against everybody to, to beat somebody out of a dollar. But then when the pool room would close and everybody would ante up at the poker table, so everybody's money's just flying. And I was like, wait a minute, why am I spending so much time learning how to play pool better when all I have to do is just stand around, you know, learn how to play poker better, and at the end of the night, everybody's just going to give their money away. So I started learning to play a little better, and there was a couple guys that had been playing cards around town, and I kind of trailed them a lot, asked them a bunch of questions, and uh, learned how to play a little better from there. I would literally go from poker game to work. I mean, there was times that I would stay up for three and four days at a time. It was more fun than working, and it was more lucrative than working. I'd have to wait all week and you know, work in the counter at A to Z drugstore or delivering Chinese food or making pizzas, whatever. I'd work all week and maybe make $200. And my friend always told me that my job was costing me money. Eventually, I built up a big enough bankroll where I could quit work and focus on just playing poker. But to me, I think aggression is the way to counter passiveness. You know, people being if you're if you're if you're play, if people are playing passive at the table, then you want to play aggressive. But nowadays, where everything everybody is bam, 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 raise, 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 aggression doesn't mean anything. You're just part of the crowd now. So um, I don't know. It's being aggressive isn't near as what it used to be. You know, the goal is to build up chips. So and, and the way to build up chips is to be aggressive. But, you know, there's a fine line when everybody knows that everybody's playing aggressive. Uh, you have to find, I think that you need to find a better way to counterattack that aggressiveness. Parliament Omaha is by far my favorite and best game. It's, it's right up my alley. It takes a lot of gambling. You have to be a little creative playing Parliament Omaha. And you play a lot of hands, and if you sit around and wait for aces or wait for kings or something, it's not going to work. And if you're, if you're too aggressive out of position, it's really just slitting your own wrists. It's, uh, so I mean I'm uh, I, I de Pot Little Mall is definitely what I love to play. I play it all the time. It's a lot of fun. You know you get to play almost every hand, and you know you're not an underdog. Well I mean yeah I mean like I said Pot Little Mall is my best game, and it was nice to be able to uh, to put myself in that position. You know it's I thought I was in that position again this year, but um. It's always, I mean, it's nice to put myself, because every time I get rolling and my thoughts are flowing right, I, I visualize victory. And I see the end of the tunnel, and I see myself winning. And in 2005, when I got to the final table of the Potlum at Omaha, it was nice to visualize victory and then do it. You know, visualize winning and then actually, you know, reaching that goal and, you know, picking up that bracelet. Because I'd visualized it so many times, and it was nice to finally do it. You can play with me at Bodog. I'm there all the time. Uh, I play 3-6 uh, Hold'em and I like to play Omaha too. And we usually get a pretty good Omaha game and the stakes are so cheap that I'm in there goofing off. And it's, uh, it's, I usually make the game pretty crazy. So come play with me on Bodog.